everybody, and welcome to Blood on the Clock Tower. I am your host, Chris the Werewolf Killer, and tonight we will be dining as an empath, as an insider. Sacre bleu, I have missed one. I don't know what this means. We will find out my number soon. In case you don't know what the empath is, you can always look down here and it's right there right now, but it's going to float away. But I will tell you. Each night, I will learn a zero, a one, or a two, which clarifies if my neighbors are good or evil. The more numbers I, the higher the number, the more evil that I have next to me. I'm predicting I'm going to get a one. Because Ned has never been good. <laughs> if Ned actually watches this later. Yeah, I just mean in the game, obviously. Because, you know, you're such a good player. For evil. For evil. So that's where we're at. I'm going to choose to not trust anybody. I'm going to lie my teeth off. I'm going to give false information. I'm planning on dying at some point. Even as the empath. It doesn't matter. Because this is a game of death and destruction. The thing is, Sam will be willing to risk a demon being in my general vicinity, I think. Because he knows I don't give much information. So he's going to be like, eh. Robert could easily be the demon. And Chris will never tell anybody. <laughs> Which could be true. We'll see. Alright. Let's wait here for Sam and get our number. And we'll talk more about this when we return. Hello. Hello. You learn a zero. Zero it is. That's what we're going to go with. <laughs> you seem distrustful of that. Well, it's always questionable. You know, now it's like, is it an Odashi? Was I widow poisoned? I guess I'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to wing it, and we're going to say that Matthew's evil. <laughs> All right, there you go. All right, good luck. All right, thanks. Matthew, you may not be evil. So I'm not going to kill you necessarily. I'm not like other people who like to just murder. I like to slowly make you think that I'm here as your friend. And then, cha -cha! And that's the end of the story. Four, eight, nine, <clears> ten, <throat> eleven. I think we're missing when, probably. Lens yeah, camera's off. Yeah, it's all good. All right, cool. Well... Uh, good morning, everybody. This is day one, and I'll give everybody about seven minutes. And uh, good luck and have fun. Okay, I'm going to make sure I got that. All right. Everybody. I would like to publicly announce that I was told that there is a widow in play, which means there should be no damsel. And then no huntsman either. Right. No. Uh, good shot. Oh, good point. Yes. Yep. Probably. All right, well, and, and, and the widow did not poison themselves. Correct. Assuming right. you're talking. Yeah. yeah, or Goami's evil. I mean, or I'm <laughs> evil. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> Which means they would have, if there's a puzzle master in play, they would have seen who was drunk, and likely we've got one drunk, one poisoned townsperson. That's true. Yep. Yeah. yeah. That makes yeah. sense. So, right. and didn't someone ask earlier? Wonderful. What? Uh, well, no, I was case... Dan asking about Poisoned While Dead. Oh, yeah, we were talking oh, about yeah. Puzzle Master and how, like, um, mm -hmm. the person will stay drunk even if the Puzzle Master dies. That's what we were talking about earlier. Yeah. So that person's just kind of... You know, I'm going to ask a semi-rhetorical question because I feel like the answer is yes. But will the widow see the drunk... Uh, person off of the puzzle master. Will they know that? Will they see that token? Uh, it's a nightmare. Are you, like, that's Sh a, should I ask the storyteller that question to be more? Yeah, we're, yeah we're, I think so. Yeah. Well, well, first, sorry, what was the question? Um, mm -hmm. Will the if there's a widow in play, which there claims to be, uh, will they see the puzzle master's drunk token if there is a puzzle master in play? They would know that. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. Crud. Uh, Kwame, can we talk? 
Sure. All right, I'll go to you. All right. Okay. Um, Anyone want to chat? Jeremy, uh, sure. you want to talk? Candace, let's do it. Let's do it. Let me see where my room one, is. Who wants to chat? Oh, we're right up here at the top. Okay. Uh, you mind? I'll chat. Yeah, I'll go to yours. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll go to mine. Okay. Okay, I clicked it. Hi, all. Would you right? like to talk? <laughs> sure. There we go. I'll go to you. Okay, who's left? As for a typical game, I feel that I'm either drunk or poisoned, probably. <laughs> That's just the way or my the life demon. goes. Well, if, if, eh, I mean, the <laughs> yeah. It'd be funny if the widow actually poisoned a demon. I feel so unpopular here. I feel like we're not the cool kids. Or maybe we are the cool kids. I don't know. Sure. But we're just too good. That's what it is. They just don't want to speak to us because we're just too good. Clearly. Yeah. Or maybe all three of you are the evil team, but I'm just sitting here chilled with you guys. Should I leave? or? No. <clears throat> I can tell them. All right, guys. So here's our three buff rolls. Uh, <laughs> they are noble... Innkeeper and Huntsman. I don't know why he gave us Huntsman. That's ridiculous, but whatever. <laughs> you could have a Huntsman and play without a damsel, though, right? Or no? No, no. Or you could add uh, Huntsman. Would, Huntsman would have to be drunk. Oh, it's or, Huntsman would oh. have to be the drunk, rather, which doesn't exist in this Which trip. could happen if the puzzles, the puzzle master is in play, maybe? Maybe. Or, I, I guess oh, that'd be maybe. a question. That's possible. It can That'd get a little chaotic. Impressive. That's interesting. And no one want to chat. <laughs> I mean, I'll chat with anybody who wants to chat with me. As the drunk or poisoned. Is that you, oh, Matthew? Man. You want to talk? Yeah. All okay. right. Okay. Let's go, buddy. Let's get this filled out. Let's go All to... right, Chris. I'll talk to you since we're the two room. lepers. It's at the very We're bottom. the two lepers in the room. I'm the son of a preacher man. Did he go to his room? I gotta check. Stop moving the screen. Matthew's not in his room. Here he comes. There he comes to save the sure, day. I was going to use Huntsman in my bluff rolls, so that's out the window. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't do that at this point. I mean, it's yeah. possible they're still in, but... It's highly unlikely. I mean, it's yeah tough to pull that off with a widow in play that knows exactly where the damsel is. Yeah, I'll give you my three savant seamstress soldier. Savant so seamstress. I'm all so I'm all the way down the bottom. Savant seamstress and soldier. Okay, I'll trust you. I suggest if you're the seamstress, not to use it right away. But maybe you, maybe you want to check somebody against me, and that way, you know, you'll get a. If you get a no, we know it's the other person because I am good. Okay. <laughs> well, what 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 are you what are you claiming? I'm fairly certain I am the the drunk by the puzzle master or the widow. How so? Just put that caveat in there. But I will say that I am possibly also the noble empath or chambermaid. Okay. So you've got a number, but it was. Yep. Yeah, I'll do. I was going to. If if I, I believe you, so I will come straight. I am the middle one seamstress. Oh, perfect. Well, then, like I said, if you check them against me, I mean, you could check them against yourself. But I'm, that, no, that's, that's not part of the role. I'm not allowed to check against oh. me. OK. Then I would definitely check against me, and we can figure it out. Yeah. And at this point, I feel no reason will, to not distrust you. Being Squammy said there's no evil in, no, there's a widow in play. I won't check against him. Okay. Well, I will trust you. Yeah. And having trusted you, I will say that I got a zero so far. Okay. Zero. Okay. I'll head back. All right, sounds good. We'll talk later. Ten seconds left for whispers. 
Ooh, oh, let's quick. oh, well, let's make this quick then. Um, Matthew, want to have a chat real quick? Yeah. All right, come to my room. I'll close the rooms after y'all leave. Don't trust Brody. All right, closing rooms now. No, I'm leaving. <laughs> no, I'm locked in here. <laughs> That was clear. <clears throat> now, can we talk tomorrow? Sorry, was that directed to me, Candace? Mm hmm. Can we Absolutely. talk tomorrow? I'm, I'm yeah. making my tea appointments for tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah, we'll continue that tomorrow, Matthew. <laughs> All right, welcome back, everybody. The last bit. You got, we got about two minutes before nominations open. You want the gossips done verbally or in chat? Yes, uh, gossips, please do those verbally. I would like to gossip that the outsider count is not two. Okay. Oh, interesting. I will gossip that Jeremy or Robert is a demon. Oh, ho, ho. Uh -oh. classic. Right. Leon yeah, starts like our hit list. <laughs> I would love to gossip. <laughs> the a the player that is Puzzle Master Thank drunk has a D in the name. Say it again, Chris. I just got Matthews. Sorry. Um, I would gossip like to, that the uh, demon is a Fangu. Got it. I would like to gossip that the player that is Puzzle Master drunk has an E in their name. Okay. I'd like to gossip Pitch out that there is no widow. No. I would like to gossip that there is no widow as well. Oh. All right. Uh, I'd, I'd like, like to, to gossip, gossip that the uh, puzzle master is not in play. Okay. I'd like to gossip that the demon is in the bottom half from Robert to Kyle inclusive. Okay. okay. I'd like to gossip that the mad, uh, the demon is within Matthew to Candace uh, clockwise inclusive. Gotcha. So yourself. Yep, I'm gonna put myself in. I'm, I'm not afraid it will narrow it down even one more. Put myself in there as well, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm in mine. I hear you. Um, I would like to gossip that between Matthew, Chris, and Ned, there's at least one evil. Matthew, Chris. All right. Gotcha. I'd like to also gossip that I am the drunk puzzle oh. puzzler. Oh, so. <laughs> and and just for clarification, that's a werewolf killer, not Chris Ain. That's it. Mm. Anyone have any information? <laughs> well, not we all have some information. A lot, a lot of nominations are open here. <sighs> On guys, remember Sam's putting this on YouTube. Yep. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah. Gotta make it look good. All right. Does everyone think they're drunk. That's that's so better than no no executions on day one. Yeah, does yeah. everyone think they're drunk? I think we need to ask that question tomorrow based on yeah. the script. Okay. I mean, so there's there's okay, does anyone want to be drunk? <laughs> 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 I'll bring that. <laughs> That's a spirit, Guami. Right. Why do you think I got this? Go, bro. <laughs> Does anybody yeah. have reason to not believe Guami's claim that he heard there's a widow in play? Yeah, the widow, please come out. <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> I have a vague suspicion, but that's, but I kind of want to sit on it for a minute because I'm not sure how it. Like it, it doesn't quite add up, but not in like a definitive way. It's entirely possible that I'm the puzzle master drunk, and that's why I'm confused. Hmm. Well, second call for nominations. Are there other? Let me look at this again. Are there other reasons that anybody would be inebriated? Let's see here. Or poison or doused. Doused. 
So yeah. Yeah. Dashi, 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 yeah. uh, Innkeeper, um, Nodashi. Yeah, there's quite a lot. Of there's, yeah. there's, yeah, there's yeah. stuff. But, uh, if you have a Viga Mortis, it will eventually once they start killing. Killing. Mm-hmm. That's true. Yeah. Okay. Basically, so, um, yeah. yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that puzzle master is going to be hard. Like, you can guess, but like, how do you really track that that's the reason that somebody's drunk? That's that's crazy. Good luck. There's a widow's right. voice. Right. It's like a guess. It's a well, guess. It's, called, it's, it's called the puzzle master of the yeah, puzzle novice. Guess. So, it's going to be <laughs> <laughs> right. True. 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 Uh-huh. Oh, my goodness. I just got a real, real puzzle to solve. Well, so, wait a minute. There's a in the game. This <laughs> no, gonna, I would like information. <laughs> I'd like to nominate uh, Werewolf Killer. Right. Call me cool. nominates Chris the Werewolf Killer. <laughs> Please state your reasoning. Uh, there's a chance that he's evil. Uh, also, I wanted to do a witch check. And you're, he was going to ask a question, and I, and I don't think anybody heard him. All That's right. it. Chris? I am saving my question because I do not want it to help the evil team, so I'm going to ask uh, later when I can talk to Stan privately. <laughs> so, anyways, I am... Uh, yeah! I am good. I would like to remain alive with the rest of you, and I would like to kill this widow followed by the demon. Let's take them out. It is Brody. Alright. Let's need six for the chopping block. Yeah, that's what I thought. Wow. <laughs> you can't say it's me and then not expect that. You know, right. Two is not well, enough. But you, <clears throat> last minute as well. Mm-hmm. Y'all know my day one speech. Y'all know you know it already. So, yep. like, yeah. I was looking at the Zoom, not the Grim. That's. <laughs> I mean, it, in in fairness, like him popping his hand up after it's past half the town is less suspicious than. That's true. I don't know. Like if, if if more people had voted and then he's like, oh yeah, you know, let's let's get this going. You know, know, what he did there, I agree with you, Jeff. He did it exactly right for being the demon, because then it's less suspicious. But it's still what he wanted to do was kill. Him. <laughs> <laughs> Just can't win. Just can't win. Right. Oh, Last call yeah. for nomination. That's when you know oh, you've been gosh. playing with a group of people so long that they, yeah. they overthink the double and the triple. If he, thing if it, if he, yeah. Mm. If he doesn't raise his hand, then that's that's just trying to fly under the radar as a demon. If right. Don't, you know, right. <laughs> <laughs> the double bluff, triple bluff. Right, right. <laughs> right. I'll nominate Brody. That's a spirit. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Robert nominates Brody. Say your case. Bam. Uh, well, Chris seems awfully suspicious of him, and yeah. you know, that's good enough for me. Robert's All good. Right. I checked. Brody, your defense? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No strong defense. Either do it or don't. But I have a uh, very good reason to believe that Guami is lying about seeing the widow. And I'm trying to keep mum until I can figure out like why that might be the case. Mm. All right. Throw a nomination this way, Brody. I don't know. Need six for the chopping block. You just went from slight suspicion to I'm possibly wrong to a very good suspicion of Guam. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was quick. Ah! It, though. It's like, you know, it's not me, oh, but I, I believe it's so <laughs> <laughs> that, Yeah, that wrapped it up enough. real quick. You got the theatrical. <laughs> Any other nominations? Right, okay. On the last call. Yeah, I'll throw a nomination Guam's way. All right, say so your case. So I'm hesitant because my like the reason why I was hesitant is because if he saw the widow, that's like a confirmed good. That's like you're confirmed good, basically. But my information suggests otherwise, and I don't really want to say much more than that because that would give way too much away. I think you've kind of already given yourself away there, but I <laughs> well, me your defense. Um, I have no doubt that I'm good. So do what you will. All right, still need six for the chopping block. Mm. This kitty cat is talking. It's mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We went on vacation hey, for Drew. a week. 
Wait, do we have Miss Kitty? Five is not enough. Yeah, they, 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 we, we, we went on <laughs> vacation a week. Story she's been, so we can't we can't blame anybody else. Or jump, or she's been account. very needy like, since we've been gone for a week. So, mm-hmm. all right. Uh, yeah. Still, last call for nominations. All right, we're going to count down from ten. Is there a noble like in play? Is it they want to come out? I'm just kind of curious. All right. The day has ended with no executions. You're making YouTube proud. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, YouTube. Uh, make sure I have everything yeah. correct. All right. Good night, well, everybody. Like subscribe. Go yeah. to bed. <laughs> <laughs> right, like Smash that subscribe. like button. Right. <laughs> like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> yes. Let's just. Do a cheap plug here. Like, share, and subscribe, folks. I love it when you do all three. It really helps because I'm just kind of needing more people to entertain. If this is entertaining to you, do all three. If it's not, do all three. And maybe I'll find somebody else who likes me. <laughs> Anyways, back to my empath. So, Brody is trying to claim he's the damsel, which isn't a bad move considering that Guami could have been evil claiming Widow to bring out a damsel who thinks that they're not. The... So I'm curious to see how this plays out. I want to see who's going to nominate or mention Brody as a damsel and then uh, see if he dies. Nobody went for it. So nobody trusts it yet, which is interesting. Which means there might actually be a widow in play. Yo, I'm Hello. still alive. You learn a zero. Oh, this is getting real t- intense now. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna see where uh, these zeros take us. Thank all right. you. All right, cool. Good luck. Yep. Thanks. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. I'm about to lose control, and I think I like it. I like it. I respect that we'll have to continue our conversation later. <laughs> All right. Good morning, everybody. Let's see. Jeremy has died in the night, and Kyle has died in the night. All right. I have to assassin. Right? I have to publicly pick a player, guys. I was the klutz. Good. All right. So, so you're claiming klutz, so you can have a moment or so if you'd like to discuss that. Can pick me, Jeremy. You can oh. trust me. Pick me. Pick yeah, he me. can pick me too. Me too. Pick yeah. Me. <laughs> oh lord. I am good. But... Jeremy, you can also pick the one other person that died last night. I'm more. No, I can't. Nah, no, I think it has to be a live player. Alive. Yeah. Alive. I, I does have to be alive. I'm fine to trust Lynn than, than Guami right now. I would I pick Brody. Jeremy picks Brody. The game has ended. I told you he was evil. I told you he was evil, Jeremy. The evil team has won. <laughs> I tried to tell you last night. Oh, my God. Yeah. And I, was and I was on the that was epic. That was epic. Good job. Jeremy, with the, hey, Jeremy, Blake isn't here, so I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it for Blake. He's not here. So here we go. Jeremy, Jeremy, Jeremy. Jeremy. <laughs> yes, please oh do it. God. How do you pick <laughs> Brody? How? Do you want to do a roll call? Right. So, so your oh evil team. Oh your, your evil team was Candace, the Poe, who charged last night. Yeah. <laughs> Kill anybody. Uh, oh my God. Brody, the assassin. Um, he used his ability to kill Jeremy, who had been <laughs> uh, protected by the innkeeper, uh, Lynn. 
Candace was also protected wow. by the innkeeper. I made her drunk since that doesn't really affect the choke po charge. And I, I didn't know Jeremy was going to die at the time, but uh, the assassin kill goes through the innkeeper project pro protection. So I thought it made more sense to drunk the demon and not an outsider who could end the game. <laughs> um, Guami was the widow. <laughs> who, as Robert, <laughs> Robert, as Robert will tell you, uh, preached, him the night, so <laughs> preached him on the very first night. So, Guami the widow never got to see the grimoire, and of course, there was never any actual widow ping. Yeah. Um, had the <laughs> preacher died or become poisoned or drunk, there would have been a widow, a widow ping. I also told Guami that I would rule that I think this technically goes against rules as written. But I would rule that he would get to see the grimoire at that point, uh, just because that seems to be uh, more fair, if that makes sense. Anyway, it doesn't matter at this point. Uh, so we'll go there on the top circle and go around. Ned was a slayer. Jeremy, of course, was a klutz. Candace was a Poe. Kyle was a clockmaker who incorrectly learned that the, the distance between the demon and minion was one because he was drunk by the puzzle master, who was Jeff. Uh, Guami's widow, Brody's assassin. Lynn was the innkeeper. Chris A was a gossip who I killed a Kyle with because I thought that'd be the simplest kill to do. Uh, Robert was a preacher. Matthew was a seamstress who last night learned that Chris the werewolf killer and Guami were not on the same team. <laughs> and um, yeah, then Chris the werewolf killer was the empath who got a zero on night one and night two. <laughs> that was your uh, two, well, one full day of uh of insiders uh, Jeremy, share... thank you. okay you you went over that way quicker than i could sorry oh, I... okay yeah cool. i was just here yeah thank you jeremy because i was really <laughs> upset when i found out that i was the demon i was like well this is gonna end quickly i didn't know it was gonna end quickly <laughs> like that but I'll it was take... robert's second choice good job matthew it was, it was candace, uh, candace. <laughs> oh he picked two evil players yeah, but it wouldn't. Yeah, have I almost the picked Brody. No, yeah, it doesn't affect the demon. But uh, I said, yeah, I, I, I said to Guami, I thought if, that Brody wasn't doing himself favors for if the preacher was going to do somebody else. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and here's the thing: I nearly picked Brody and Guami, so I would have gotten a yes for that. Mm -hmm. You would have gotten a yes. That yeah. would have been great. Well, I thought Guami was evil, so I thought that kind of cleared Brody. Mm. Jeremy, <laughs> Jeremy, <laughs> Jeremy. <laughs> well, that was a. I don't know. Is it? I feel like they could have probably really gone on with that whole Brody versus mm -hmm. Wally thing and, and got somewhere. It was smart. It was really just smart. Basically just distract the town. Mm -hmm. I didn't like this setup. I just wanted to get this one out of the way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I agree, I agree, Jeremy. Yeah. That's why I used my gossip to try and hopefully narrow that down this the version down, of right. the this this version of I meant to do And that. you killed me, Chris. <laughs> you killed <laughs> your gossip. The gossip uh, was the gossip. Yeah. Well, and, what was it? What was your um, the player does his puzzle master drunk has an E in their name. Which oh. all does. Mm. I, fig I figured that you were the guy who saw how specific it was. I, mm. yeah. well, already had his information, so. Yeah. I apologize, good team. Damn. I saw. <laughs> when Jeremy, Jeremy, Jeremy. Nobody's going to deny when, that. That's <laughs> the dangers of the clutch. So oh, we're we playing again, and uh, Chris and Jeremy are dropping out. Is that. We could have won day one. We could have so, won day one, Kyle. I, I feel like um I feel like with the script it's kind of good balanced, generally speaking. Mm. But I think that's why Klutz and Damesor are important in the script. And it's nice to have a shorter game once in a while. I legitimately <laughs> talked to Jeremy no. at the beginning yes. of the game and I said, Jeremy, uh, it's going to be kind of boring, isn't it? And I said, well, you could always just choose the wrong person and then the game's over. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm um, really thinking about it too. Bless wow. his heart. <laughs> I'm begging you, Sam. I'm don't a... put this on YouTube. <laughs> I'm putting it on YouTube. Oh, please. Oh, it's going please on YouTube. On YouTube. Twice. 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 It has to go up there. I already talked to Steven. He's putting it on. Chris is putting it on. I, 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 I talked to uh, No Rules Bard. They're putting it up. <laughs> every, every angle possible. Um, but now I'm, I'm, I'm here for running a second game for anybody...
Well, that's it for game here on Blood on the Clock Tower Insider Edition. The terrible cluts <laughs> cost the good team the game. I told him many times, and I pointed at myself, and he would not pick me. He's like, I'm going to pick evil, or I'm going to pick evil, or I'm going to pick evil. And he messed it up for a good team. I told him Brody is evil. Oh, well. Next time. So here we go. Hope you enjoyed that quick little game of Blood on the Clock Tower.